What's up guys, here is Claudio from Visual Moto WordPress Teams and in today's video you're gonna learn how to use the timeline of layers into your WordPress Revolution Slider plugin in its version 6 or up this version. First of all, we're gonna move to our WordPress dashboard, Revolution Slider, and as soon as you hover your mouse over the pencil icon of your slider, you're gonna be loading the slider editor. As soon as you load the slider editor, you can see that it are full with elements because you already have made your slider. If you did not make this, just check out our Revolution Slider playlist on our YouTube channel. But if you have made your slider, you're gonna not see into the down part of your site, the bottom right, the bottom left, sorry, of the layers. It's almost like the Photoshop. If you click in a slider layer or a slider element, you can see that the slider has a timeline. The duration of this timeline, it's by the full nine seconds. And you can change it by following the video tutorial that I'm gonna leave a link in the description below and our card over here, probably. But if you click on a slider element, you can see that it has a duration for the in, the showing up effect, and a duration for the showing out effect. Using this, you can almost play with all the sliders elements and how they gonna display the order and organize it. All you need to do is hover your mouse over some part of this element. For example, here we have the church desk. And if you click this hover and drag it or drop, drag it and drop down or up, you can change where this element gonna appear, when this element gonna appear. And if you change this 1000, for example, click here over and give a play on the slider so you can see this church desk element gonna do its animation and appear before all the other slider elements because we move that you can do the same with the showing out the out effect this element gonna be the last one to appear and the first one to disappear simple fast and easy using this technique you can change and organize all the slider elements just pay an extra attention because the undo process it's a pretty harder in this plugin actual version so i recommend that you do a minor change save your change and if you do not like the final result just reload the page for a previous saved version or even import or export the slider before this kind of editions in the case that you are not familiar with this kind of editor as you can see, you can, all you need to do is click on some slider layer or element and be able to change the amount of time that the effect, the animation takes. I'm gonna record a video for animations. So just subscribe to the channel so you can see it. But for now, I hope this guide helps you to understand the timeline on Revolution Slider WordPress plugin. And it is. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Feel free to use the comment section below in the case that you have any question. And don't forget to check out the visualmoto.com portfolio of amazing WordPress teams. And I see you later. All the best!